Alright, so hello everybody. This is just Blue Hawk here. We're, we're gonna be playing Anime Fire Simulator for this update. This uh, this is update 19. This is actually my very first video on this channel, so um if you came here from the boys Martin, um the last video, whatever it's gonna be, whatever I'm gonna make. Um welcome, hi, hello to my channel. Make sure you subscribe if you're new to the channel. Make sure to turn on notifications and if you wanna make sure you comment and all and then I'll make more videos if I get some more likes and stuff. But yeah no. Alright, so we're gonna get alright, so we're gonna get started on this on this update. So we have update 19 here. If we're gonna if we're gonna go over here, this is the new island called Kingdom of Four. The Kingdom of Four is basically the anime called Fairy Tale, which if you haven't seen Fairy Tale, it's a very good anime. Even though I haven't watched it yet, but the characters I think the char the characters I think are very good. I don't have the secret, but I'll show it to you on screen when I have. When I rather, when I rather have the secret, when I rather have the secret, or when, or when I get someone else's secret. All right, all right. So right now, I'm gonna give you the secret enemy location on this map. Here we go now. So, so what you gotta do is get past. And you gotta go straight. Well, you could go any direction, but you, but you, you could go any direction. But as of right here, so no. You see this odd looking shade of color with the, with these rocks. Well this rock right here. You, you get up to enter in this rock and then you'll find the secret enemy called Amnesia. Basically basically it's referring to the to the gym to the Chimera jungle secret when you find when you find Cat Girl, so yeah. Next up is the new incubator in Flame City, which if you go over to Flame City, um, they need to fix this by the way, but they need to add the, they need to add that incubator icon. But if you teleport over to it, here is the incubator, which basically instead of two incubators you can put three in. And and speaking of incubators, the the little cap increased to two fifty, so basically I used to have these um maxed out my own steel and gift from god basically my shiny clarent no not clarent dark sh sh shiny bravery dark and my shiny dark one but now i'm gonna have to put them back into the incubator again and basically it's gonna take me three and a half weeks so basically a one or two updates pretty sure the ma i'm pretty sure the max level cap is probably gonna stay until like the next three updates Next up, we have the new Kingdom Store in Lucky Kingdom. So basically, if you go over to Lucky Kingdom, there's going to be a new store over here, which is the, which is called the Kingdom Store. Basically, it's the exact same as the other Robux stores. You could just spend your Robux on here and get different characters on there. Next up is the new Lucky One, Two, and Three passives. Three passives. So basically, what they do. It's basically self-explanatory. The name is in the name is in by itself, which basically you could get a certain type of percentage of luck. But just like the God passive, you can't roll. You can't roll the lucky heroes. Next up, just spawn past room 100 time trial. Well, I'm not going to do the time trial right now, but I do got that on recording so you can see the chest. Basically, what the chest does is while you defeat it. You're gonna get more shards than getting just one from a particular enemy. You could get rather like six or ten, six to ten shards if you defeat that, if you destroy the chest. But it's a pretty low spawn, so you're not gonna get it all the time. But sometimes you could get one chest, sometimes you could get four chests. So the raid drops increase. So this, so basically, I'm gonna give you. A video of my raid over at Nine Crimes Island. You can see that I got six, which means I'm pretty sure you could get like five or f between like five to eight shards. Now, I don't know the exact count, but you used to get three to five shards. The timer is gonna be so annoying. The new DPC leaderboard. The new DPC. The new DPC leaderboard is another leaderboard they added over at Super Island, so you can check it. So you can check it out right now. And then, last but not least, 
we have bug, fi bug fixes, balance changes, and improvements, which I'm gonna show you a couple of them. I'm gonna I'm gonna show you the teleporter, like once you teleport inside of the time trial, and from my from my video one from my video once I did the land of alchemy update to now, and the next up inside of the defense mode in Divine Colosseum. Instead of three Odins, you're gonna get four on the last wave. So that's a, so that's a huge improvement. If you want to get some more stars, you could do that. I'm going to show you a couple of fighter, a couple of good fighters what I got. I'm going to show you a couple of clips of how I got these heroes and how I got how I got pretty lucky off of them. So yeah. Okay, yeah, so Okay, yeah, so you do get so you get so you do get 20 plus shards. So yeah. They literally did buffed up its uh, raid shards. Alright, so I'm gonna take off for, on this video for right now. So I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. Make sure to subscribe and put and turn on notifications if you want to see more of my videos. So, until next time, peace.